This is the Infinity Photo Optical K2 Distamax. It was described in an earlier session uh, for use on a laboratory support stand. Here we're going to show you a part two on the K2. Uh, this instrument is made in America, in Colorado. And uh, the beauty of this particular rig that you'll be seeing is its ability to focus to infinity from a close working distance of 27 inches. That's 27 inches. And if you do a Google search on long distance microscopes, this is the instrument that will pop up and you can take a detailed look at the Infinity website. Just go to the K2 Distamax and you'll see all the particular specs. Uh, here at the end of this microscope is the newest NWE lens and that NWE lens uh, gives us the ability to focus to infinity or as close as 27 inches. As you'll see in a later uh, version and on the website you can put a front adapter onto the NWE lens and actually use microscope objectives here on the front. So uh, it's an interesting system for those who require long distance uh, uh, for their microscopy, such as looking at uh, detailed objects or defects or works of art from a long distance. A good example would be a large statue in a museum to monitor uh, uh, cracks or mold or anything that requires some magnification at a relatively long distance that would make it impossible to drag a microscope up close. So uh, uh, I think this instrument has some merits here. At the other end of the unit uh, for the demonstration is a three chip one half inch CCD censored camera and we'll be going live to that camera onto a monitor so that you can see what's happening. Uh, I wanted to point out though that this C-mount adapter is easily replaced on the K2 Distamax with another adapter that allows you to use a full frame 35 DSLR camera. Uh, that translates to a diagonal of uh, 43 millimeters. The diagonal of the chip in this camera that you see is 8 millimeters. So uh, you have a much wider field of view and a much better resolution going on with a modern DSLR camera. So we'll uh, move away from this and then go to uh, uh, a demo of the unit uh, on a monitor that I've got set up here. Let me get that all composed for you, and then we'll take a look at some things. I'm a one-man show here today, cameraman, moderator, the whole deal. So, uh, excuse my walkthrough. We're now going to move the camera so that we have a uh, view of something off at a distance. Uh, here you'll see about oh, 50 or so feet away there's a little window on my back basement door. It's a warning sign of course facing the other way. Uh, that's about 50 feet away and I'm focusing internally on the K2 Distamax and we can then quickly look at something a little closer such as this object. It's not a flying saucer. It's actually a 6 inch recessed light fixture that again is 40 feet away and I'm now going to bring the microscope in all in real time and we're going to look at an old friend here. I think 
most of you will recognize this guy. It's Bart Simpson. And Bart is there with the scale lit. He's about, oh, eight feet away from the lens of the NWE lens. And his head in real time is about one inch tall from from his chin to the top of his hair is about one inch. So you can see what a half inch sensor is doing for us uh, directly on the monitor. And that's the important thing is what is the field of view on the monitor? We really don't care that much about magnification specs without knowing the size of the monitor that we're going to be viewing from. So we'll take this a little bit further and I'm now going to scan down to something that's uh, closer yet to our to our microscope and this is uh, within the realm of the near focus we're at about 28 inches away from a 1 8 uh, a 1 inch uh, SMD component unit that's roughly that whole field that from that side of the uh, package to that side is about one inch. So we're getting a field of view of about a half inch here. And we are now a little over two feet working distance. 28 inches we're at exactly. And you can see the image quality even with an old time half inch sensor we can see individual uh, chip pads and wires and uh, if we had on the back end a uh, modern 50 megapixel DSLR camera it would be a whole different story in terms of resolution so uh, that shows you the range of the K2 Distamax I thank you for your kind attention and uh, Feel free to visit the Infinity website, www.infinity-usa.com. And uh, these systems are available from authorized representatives. Uh, and we look forward to hearing from you, and maybe we can be of service. Thank you.